Hello, everybody. Welcome back to OCRP. Once again, we are going to be doing a patrol in Los Santos, and we have to deal with a lot of robberies, including a shootout. Metro 127. 127. You can show me 10 8 out of 217. 10 4 at 2211. I guess he's just going to take that pump, isn't he? Is that weed on pallets? Um, is that weed on pallets? Because it looks like marijuana. Yeah, you said you'd be here. <laughs> oh, oh, man. Hey, how you doing today? I'll be doing fun, sir. How about you? Uh, I'm doing all right. What is that? Cade. Is what? Cade. Cade? Cade. Kale. Yes. Uh, K-A-L-E? Yes. Oh, okay, where'd you pick it up? Uh, right down the street, sir. Okay. So they sell kale down there? They got a farmer's okay. market down there on uh, Grove Street? Yes, yes. They sell the best unit. kale ever. Prepare to copy a bolo. Okay. All right. Be sure. Bolo for a parade of what appears to be Crown Vix that oh, are okay. heading towards 13, possibly from Panorama. All right, sounds good. We'll have a nice day. Be a bolo only Enjoy your kale. Do, for possible reckless driving. Yes. <laughs> have a beautiful day. And here he comes. Uh, it's gonna be two zero three, uh, strawberry at textile. Incoming nine one one. Step four. He knew he was getting pulled over immediately. Uh, <laughs> Metro 127. Metro 127. Yeah, I'll be uh, 1050 out here at uh, 129. Can you start me an additional unit? I've got a uh, vehicle that appears to be transporting large amounts of uh, kale, a.k.a. marijuana. We're just going to do a drug test on it. We're just going to do a uh, reagent test to make sure that it's not marijuana and we'll let them be on their way. We'll wait for Matt to get over here. He's going to love this one. Can you or 305 head to 127 at postal 129 Davis and Carson for a 1050? Hello, sir. Again, how you doing today? My name is Officer Faviano with the LSPD. Reason for the stop is uh, for multiple pallets of a uh, a substance that appears to be uh, narcotic related. No, no, I told you it's kale. I understand that you're telling me that, but you're taking it out of a known drug area. So we're just going to do our due diligence and make sure everything's good. You have your driver's license on, you prove insurance of the vehicle. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, here we go, sir. It's Dimitri Petrovsky. Dimitri Petrovsky? Yes. All right. If you don't mind writing that on a piece of paper and sending that over to me like that, yes, oh, I appreciate you, you doing that. Uh, you, have, you don't even warrant nothing like that, right? No, I don't think so. All right. So here's the deal. We have another unit coming down. Uh, what we're going to do is just do what we call a reagent test. Make sure that that's kale. If that's kale, I'm going to let you be on your way. If it's something else, we'll, uh, we'll have a chat about it, okay? Do you mind uh, turning the vehicle off and, uh, and hanging out on the sidewalk for me? Yes, the car is off. All right, I appreciate that. It's a nice Tahoe. Do you mind just hanging out on the uh, sidewalk over there on the right? Yes, of course, of course. All right, you don't have any weapons on you? Nothing's gonna, nothing like that? No, no. you no. mind if I check to make sure you have no weapons? Yes, sir. Yeah, sure. All right, I appreciate the cooperation. It could just be a big misunderstanding, but uh, we've we've had a lot of drug activity coming out of that uh, out of that cul-de-sac there in the past. So nothing here. Is this your keys right here? And yes. your wallet right there. Okay, cool. All right, awesome. I'm gonna have uh, these two officers hang out with you for a minute. I'm just gonna make sure you don't have any warrants or anything like that, okay? And then uh, we'll we'll continue on. You can just hang out with these guys right here, but I pr prefer you be over there on the uh, sidewalk. He's got a uh, caution code on him. Uh, records here. Arrests, priors for uh, fleeing and eluding. Possession of stolen vehicle, reckless driving. 
So nothing drug yeah, related there. License is right here. It's it's good to go. It's approved. It's suspended. He's driving a suspended license. That's not good. Can't be doing that, buddy. I'm sorry, last year I had background oh, so tonight. All right. This. So do you know what's going on with your driver's uh, license? Because it's showing suspended out of state of San Andreas and your uh, your, your tile's expired uh, tags. Oh. Uh, catch up to a crime. Oh, yeah. Oh, that might be from last time I was driving expired my, or suspended my license. Okay, I got you. I'm going to start uh, this, uh, right this reagent test, guys, if you want to handle that. Positive for marijuana. All right, boys, uh, 10 15. All right, no worries. All right, so go ahead and uh, just face away. Face the uh, Bishop's Chicken Forest. Large amounts of marijuana, man. It came back positive what? for marijuana. That is not kale. I don't know who told you that. So that's guessing Grove told me was kale. Well, it's not kale, it's marijuana, and it's a large amount, which is felony amounts. So that's one of the problems. But the other problem is you're driving on a suspended license, and then your your truck's not registered, dude. Oh. Yeah, he just hit a bong, too. There's a bong no. in the passenger seat. Yeah. No. A bong? Okay. Yeah, he just yeah, he was in a bong of kale. Oh, okay. Well, <laughs> you have the right to remain silent. Yeah. Anything you say... Uh, can and will be used against you in the court of law. You write to an attorney if you can't afford one. One will be appointed by the state of San Andreas. You understand these rights, sir? Yes, sir. With these rights being read to you, do you wish to uh, continue to talk to us about everything? Yeah, yeah, sure. I have nothing to hide. Okay, so where did you Juliet, pick these up? I told me Grove Street. Uh, at end of Grove Street. Show me on scene. I'm just going to okay, the area gotcha. for a suspicious van. All right. Uh, so the 10 I'm seeing canvassing the area. 2245. Yes. How much did you spend on this kale? Good question. Yeah, it's like two thousand dollars. I searched in my founder's wallet and it's like busting with money in it. Uh, okay. Two thousand dollars. Yep, that, that makes sense. What are you doing with the kale, man? Are you are you reselling it or? Ten four. Yes, I sell to vegans. Oh, so you sell the kale? Yes. Uh oh. So you, you you oh. weigh it up and put it in little baggies and then distribute it. <laughs> No, I just sell it in bricks. Oh, you just sell it in bricks. Oh, large quantity distribution, gotcha. Metro 127. You don't sell it. 127. Yeah, just an update. Right now, we got 110.15 for possession of uh, marijuana on a large scale, and then we've got uh, expired uh, tags, and we got a suspended license. All right, man. Well, you're going to jail for uh, possession of marijuana, lar oh, felony amount of amount. marijuana, uh, driving on a suspended license, and then... You're going to get a ticket for the, not having uh, your vehicle registered in San, San Andreas. So that's what you're looking at right now, those three uh, those three things, okay? Okay. And also distributing marijuana as well. It's not a big deal if you have, like, a small amount on you, like we'd confiscated or whatever. It's kind of, you know, gets a slap on a wrist, you get a ticket. But when you have pallets of it like that on the back of your trailer, that's whenever things are bad. I know they say marijuana makes you lazy, but I don't think they needed a forklift. <laughs> Oh man, unbelievable! Metro 127. 127. You show me clear. I'll be back 10-8. 10-4. Uh, 2055. We it is going westbound 94. Want to try to catch up to it. 10-4. Yeah. Oh, he just ran that red. He's gonna run with the police. I have a feeling. Oh, he's stopping, looks like, for police. Must be out here with him. 1050, it's going to be 134 Strawberry Avenue on a gray two-door Chevy Corvette. Occupied times one. Yeah, I saw him run that red. I was going to flip around on him, and then uh, you went after him. So I'll just be out here with you. You got that one right after the the gas station up there, and then hit this one too. Yeah, I, I think about it stopping for this one, but yeah, I'm not sure what that's about. One two seven. What was your traffic? All right. Oh, one two seven. I'm the one out there with uh, with the uh, three o five. For the stop, man, I got you with two red light violations. You uh, you blew through the first one. Looked like you were gonna stop at the second one, but you continued to go through it. You got your uh, license registration proof of insurance tonight? Yeah, let me hand to you. Okay. What's the uh, what's the hurry, man? There you go. Uh, I'm just 
trying to get down to the the docks. I gotta get my stuff from work. I left some stuff at work. Gotcha. Left stuff at work at the docks. Is that Mr. Erickson? Yeah. I got you. All right, well, hang out with this officer. I'll go ahead, run you. Make sure everything's clear. All right. Any uh, weapons, narcotics, anything in the vehicle tonight? No, not tonight. Well, no, not at all. <laughs> good, good, good answer. But I'm gonna be honest with you. I, I think I have a suspended license. Okay, we appreciate that honesty. We'll see what we can do do for you there. You know why it's suspended? Yeah, I I work for the postal service, and I was. Um, up in the county doing some deliveries the other day and I was late so I was speeding around and I got some that were a little too fast. Yeah, he said he's probably suspended. 10 four, I'm showing zero eight no, four he's on coming a back to call. Bell. Okay. He was, he was worried that he was suspended because he's been stopped so many times for speeding. Yeah, I know the vehicle has uh, got two speeding charges. He does have a lot of speeding uh, citations, but zero, no, eight, he's four, coming back Senator. clear valid. Vehicle's Good. valid. All right, man. So okay, some good news sure and some bad one, news. You want the good news them. or the bad news first? Yeah, uh, do the bad news, I guess. All right. Bad news is that you're getting uh, two citations for running the red lights. But the good news is you're not suspended. You're you're valid. Oh, good. Well, that well that's good. Did you want a secondary? I was yeah. almost certain I was suspended. All right. At this time, I got two uh, citations for you. It's going to be the double plate, red light violation. Sign of mission to guilt. Man, to say you're going to take care of me for it. Pay the fine. Uh, information on the back older so Honda, how to take care of it. Uh, if not, your point will be 30 days out from today, 9 a.m. Uh, here in Ellis. 10-4, I'll run that tape. Yeah, right. you sign right. the back. Again, it's not an admission to go to Mandis. We'll see you're going to take care of it. Okay. All right, take care of yourself now. There you go. Uh, thank right, man, you. I appreciate it. Yeah, just, uh, you know. Of All right, so, yep. Yeah, guy ran two red lights. We saw the first one. We we're going to flip around, but. 190 metric. Uh, Good. Devin was right there to catch him, so back, no big deal. Uh, it is a green Honda Accord registered to a, a stolen vehicle, it sounds like. Go ahead and just self-clear off of this, since they're busy on the radio. Ten four. And we I've are 10 eight. Come across a residence with lights on. Uh, it's going to be the more south side of 438. I'm going to be searching it now, see if there's any persons I can see through windows. I head up that direction in case they need us. Ten four. The description we've got is a white male, pink jacket, blue jeans, long brown hair, black. Yeah, he's out of that way too. Ten four. Going to the rear. Three oh five. You were waiting. Yes, sir. You can show me ninety eight eight. Uh, two citations given. Ten four. Three oh five. Ninety eight eight. Metro one on the purple shoot. White male, uh, pink jacket, running westbound East Road Drive. Three of five, He's getting in the green Honda, taking off, 1031. 31. I'm trying to get back to my vehicle, last seen in Spirit Drive. Green Honda Accord, older style. Yeah, first, got back to my car. Give me a minute, let's get over to the mirror. I got him, he's out here, he's in the street. He's over by the, uh, the customs. Getting into a black. There he goes. Incoming unit, he's in that car to your west, driving down there. You got him. 127, I'm uh, primary on that vehicle. Looks like a Glendale, black in color at uh, 420, unless the secondary can call it. 104127, showing you attached to the call now. Secondary, can you call? We're on, uh, we're at 413. We're on Bridge Street now, going uh, westbound right now. Yeah, I got it. All right. Eastern westbound, Bridge Street, close to 405. Speed, second, E5. Uh -huh. Whoa. Right, left turn on Elgin. Right turn on Spanish Avenue. Uh, left up here, make it right turn to the alleyway. Take a right turn on to Alta. He's out of options here. Right turn down another alleyway. 
Uh, he's on foot. Right there by that unit. Yep, right here. Power Street, Power Street. Give it up, dude! You're gonna get tased or tackled! One two seven. He's right westbound. Westbound. We're crossing over. Uh, crossing over Alta Place right now. Uh, five eight zero. Five eight zero at the green building. No, no. I give up. I give up. He's giving up. He got out with challenging. I give up. Challenging one. I'm Just stay right there. Stay right there, dude. Five eight zero. Alta Place. I have, I have a gun in my. On my five eight zero. I got you, Jeff. I got you. All right, man. Challenging one at five eight zero. And I'm ten fifteen. Damn, what you running for, dude? Hold no longer in effect. You caught, you caught me red-handed. Yeah. Ooh. Good stuff. <sighs> I'm gonna catch my breath. Uh, I just didn't know if he had a weapon or not. That's the reason why I didn't. Uh, I didn't uh, go non-lethal. I was by myself. I don't, I don't mess around with that. So we're gonna search this Glendale. See what we find. It's more likely a stolen vehicle. Yeah, there's nothing in here. I'll just get this thing towed. There he is. OC tow in the house. Hey, what's up? Hey, man, how you doing? Yeah, doing all right. Been a hot minute. Hey, that uh, that Glendale got stolen out of uh, out of Mirror Park and led us on a, a crazy uh, chase, and here it is. Oh yeah. All right, yeah, I'll take care of that. Uh, where do you want to take it to? Uh, you can just take it up. Um, you can take it to the Davis impound lot. Davis? Yep. Yep, I can take it there. Yep, that'll four work for me. Okay, cool. You need yeah, anything from me? Works. No, paper works. One Mac. Now, so. Oh, nice. All right, man. Well, Thank you. awesome. This Good to see you. Team. I'll uh, see you around tonight. Yep. So yeah, man. Zero five ten traffic. I got two units going after it. We're just gonna head up that way. And three or five. Do you have a postal for that silent arm, please? Just okay. Uh, just in I case. Can get you one when we arrive. I haven't got one right now. In case he gets shot at or something, we'll be in the area. Show fire, one, show fire. Shot one, two, seven. Can you attach, please? Zero, two, five as well. One to seven or out. Three, five, one, two. One to seven, same traffic. One to seven. Metro 1A is possibly still inside. I'm just not going to peek this corner until I've got more units with me. 10 4. All right. Uh, make sure he wasn't back there in that little alleyway. Yeah, I don't see anyone. All right, I'm back. 10 4. We've got a couple more units arriving. and we'll uh, clear inside. Go over this yeah. way. Oh! Shots being fired. Shots fired. Subject still inside. He's probably in that back room. You guys see where those shots came from? Negative. It might be in that back room. I'll try to see if I can draw his gunfire out. To me, it looked like they were almost to the left side of the building. Five one three, Senator. Five thirteen. Five thirteen. Yeah, I didn't see where those were coming from. Park Boulevard to assist Metro units with a uh, shots fired situation. Ten four ten eighteen. Yeah, we got to be behind the counter. It's gonna be a whiskey Mike white shirt. Okay. Yep. There he is, right there. I see him. Yeah, I got eyes on him. I got one on the left side down, left side of the building, on the south end. One down, left side, south end. I think I just shot him in the head. I'm I'm coming around from the back. Because the so screen have, flashed. That usually is what that means. Four one one. Can we get medical started? Ten, have an four, officer four, down. down Son of a. You good, man? Yeah, I'm just trying to bandage this guy up real fast. All right. Clear on the left, from what I can see.
Tedris. Big police, call out. LSPD! 416, you direct. He might be in the back. Go for 416. Uh, we're pretty much wrapping up here. You, can go you good in there? 10 4. You good in there? Yeah, we're clear. You good? Hello? They're down. Yeah, there's there's the other subject that was shooting. Okay, so we so we did have two subjects shooting? 127. Uh, the uh, building is clear right now. We got two subjects down. So this is what happened to Matt right here. There he is. He's engaging the gunfire right there on the side, and he gets struck by looks like three bullets right there and he's down all, all right, right so this person comes in pilot. and they're holding him up uh -huh. this might have been just a worker the ltd worker got shot by this person i don't think they were the ones that were firing originally inside and they ran out and they came back in there's the gunfire happening right there back and forth and they go in there and they shot him right there so as an employee they got shot by yeah, this person that's why they were down back. They were inside and they shot ahead, at cops and then went outside. No, there's two shooters, two shooters. Got one right here in a white. There's one at large. Hold on. We're going to go ahead and uh, pause this. I have further 43 uh, for our shooting here at 411. Uh, there was a second subject that uh, bailed. I'm going through the cameras now. It's a white female in a white tank top, blue jeans, wearing night vision on their head and they have a shaved head all right so i reviewed the footage of everything um ltd worker in there was just working um they were shot uh in cold blood after being robbed that subject bailed out of the building ran south there were two of them there was a white female uh as well with the the one with the hit with the uh the colored hair and they ran out to the south they flanked 190 Four, one, over six, here and shot three shots yeah, into 190 10, then nine. continued back around the corner i shot 10, six, them four, put one, them six. down on the south end of the building and then the other one's still at large okay so we have a white female no hair all white uh last seen headed southbound yeah last Zero, seen two, on five, foot running southbound uh, and they had a automatic weapon in their hand and night vision goggles on their head. Check, please, sir. Okay, we didn't happen to see a, uh, uh, escort, no, a the, vehicle uh, with it. They didn't jump into no, the vehicle or No, no, I saw no vehicle at all. They were on foot. But yeah, they just, they robbed them and they weren't, it wasn't going well. They came around the corner and then they just shot them right there behind the uh, counter. Got another silent alarm down in Grove Street. That might be our subjects again. Uh... More than likely. So this might be our second subject uh, trying to rob another place. We're going to be on scene here shortly. Yeah, it's at uh, Grove Street uh, 119 at the LTD. Here's our backup showing up on scene. And we're going to clear the building once they get in here. Move up a little bit. All right, he's going to go in the back. I'm going to go in the front. The uh, right side alley looks LSPD! Clear. 025 Metro, you're on scene now. Affirmative. LSPD! 10-4. LSPD, make yourself known. Right behind you. We're just here. They're back here. They probably went right out that door. And it's a different person this time. That is a simple robbery and ran straight out. Yep, he's got a, looks like a wristwatch on, or a bracelet on the right arm. And he does have a mustache. Ten, four, That's all I can see. Right arm and a mustache. Yeah, he was last seen just uh, on foot running to the west. One nine zero one two seven Metro. 197. 190. 190, 127. New call for you now at 133 Innocence Boulevard. Uh, this will be the Vanilla Unicorn parking lot. You're looking for a suspicious vehicle, possible uh, DUI. 
Right. One, two, seven, show me in or out. One, two, responding. Ten, four. You know, see call details for more information. All right, we'll look at the call details when we get there. That vehicle right there whipping around. Oh, there's another unit going in there. That's 190, I think. There's the vehicle right there. This looks like our guy. Metro 197, we've got the vehicle here. Yeah, 127, same traffic. This is going to be the subject that uh, just robbed LTD. 10-4. I'll get behind you for failing. 10-4. Driver! There he goes. Get in. He's taking off. 31. 1031 now. Taking a right and a right. Anderson Boulevard, West Ham. 1 to 7, I'll take call outs. Yeah, we're heading towards Legion Square right now on uh, Elgin Avenue northbound, passing 200 at the ammunition. It's going to be a black uh, expedition, newer model. Now right turn eastbound uh, 206 on Vespucci. Now we're going to be making a left turn on Strawberry. Northbound Strawberry at Legion Square right now, 205. Continuing northbound past Pillbox Hill, getting on the 1, uh, 207 right now. Speeds around 80 miles per hour. Still northbound, 405 on the one past the CNT building. We're going to be continuing northbound past Vinewood uh, track here. We're going to be towards the dam on 13 now, 400. Traffic conditions are light, road conditions are dry. Channel hold down, effect for pursuit. Passing the way station, 723, northbound 13. Still northbound 13. We're going to be staying on the 13 towards Sandy Shore. Staying on the 13 at the loop. Northbound 13721 coming up on Ron Alternate's wind farm right now. And bowling broke. Northbound 13945. Last unit from Toledo 10-9. Be near the Sandy Shores exit, taking the Sandy Shores exit on to 68. Be at 959 be a left turn on Route 68, westbound Route 68. We're going to be taking Panorama, northbound Panorama past Yellow Jack, 950. We're going to be multi-agency now if, uh, if they want to help out. Brake checkers, watch out. I want to try and keep distance. Yeah. We're going to be uh, 10, 1020. I get a right turn on a Joshua. We'll be eastbound on Joshua Road, 1025. Passing the 24 7 eastbound on Joshua Road. Now making the left on Marina. He's going to be north on Marina. Just struck the Sandy Shore sign. This might be it. Challenging one. I got you covered. Final stop, 1036 at the Sandy Shore sign on Marina and Joshua Road. We got them 1015. You can lift the channel. Channel hold no longer in effect. That was some desync nation there. Holy moly. What do you mean? 115 513 San Andreas. What do you mean? 
What do you mean? What do you mean? Face your vehicle. Face your vehicle. It's not mine. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. Oh, thanks five, for admitting five, that. You want anything on you? Head down to the city, please. Beer. Assist with a, uh, a call. So I have pretty good to your room, dude. Ten four coming uh, around. You got anything on you? I'm gonna fire. Five thirteen, safe traffic. Ten four, you're both. You know what you have on you, right? Tell me what you have on you. Amarillo Vista. Okay. And I think. Any call you know. notes for details. Continuation of the previous call. Okay. This is a mess. <laughs> he crashed right in the Sandy Shore sign. That's amazing. You understand your rights that I just read to you? Yeah. Okay, with those rights being read, do you wish to continue to talk to us? Uh, 025, go ahead. All right. Were you at the LTD earlier tonight? Uh, I was at a bunch of them. Why? The one there at Grove Street? Yeah, I got gas there. Okay, you got gas there? In this vehicle? Uh, no. All right. Well, I mean, we have you on uh, camera there robbing the place, man. I mean, the, uh, uh, really? I'll, I'll release it to you one night. I just wanted to ask him about that. Yeah, no, absolutely. What's the pipe? Uh, it would be a meth pipe, sir. Okay, meth pipe. Cool. <laughs> yeah, this, cool. Uh, baggy here. This would be the cocaine you were talking about. Yeah, and I think in the right pocket is uh, maybe pet, uh, meth. Okay. Something nice. like that. So um, you had him robbing one twenty four seven. Yeah, he's the one who uh, robbed the LTD. Got him on camera. Identical. Even has the the bracelet watch on. The bracelet nice. and watch okay. taken off. One seven new call for you. You're heading to one eight four Amarillo. Let's <laughs> take this truck. My vehicle. One to seven copy. Four to speed at the time. One fifteen for your primary. Can I get a call? Uh, We're gonna be eastbound on Amarillo Vista. All right. So they've managed to come all the way around. And they're going northbound now. In a uh, no, that's a that is not a bobcat. Coming up on to thirteen. All right, be in that pursuit. Looks Four like we're fourth. Very slow speed pursuit. This is an interesting one. Careful, dude! He's gonna hit you. I don't know what that guy's doing. Absolutely smash into you. Well, we can kind of just... Hey, with the suspect now. He's screaming that he needs the money. Oh, he needs the money. Okay. Suspect screaming needs money. He needs money. Here, okay. Here. I got a rush lock off. Turned around, heading southbound on the 13, headed back to the city. Okay. Nothing's really changed here. We're just, uh, we spun around. Now we're going back southbound. He's still at 30 miles an hour. Yeah, around 30 mile an hour on the speed. And he's been shouting that uh, he needs money. Oh, he just hit somebody. He just struck a 78. He's taking a right integrity way underneath the tunnel. Uh, parallel to pillbox. Now we're uh, going to be heading west under low power street here. We're making a turn. Not like we're in a huge hurry to clear an intersection there. Left, south power street, I guess nobody else saw him hit that person, so perhaps that wasn't on their screen. We would normally hear the uh, primary unit. Call that out if that were the case. But very slow speed pursuit still going on downtown with this uh, this vehicle here. <laughs> These AI drive like such garbage. Now we're going to be heading into Little Soul here. Speeds are been managing about 30 miles per hour. Nothing's changed there. Speed's 20 miles an hour. If you want, I can take call outs. Be 369, still westbound. 
San Andreas Ave. Be heading in a little soul here. Still continuing westbound over Movie Star Way. We're at 364. We're heading towards Vespucci now in the police station. Pit timer expired. We're going to be staying on San Andreas Ave right now. 342 passing burger shot. I think the vehicle was pit maneuvered. Got to be on foot. Running yep. southbound. He got it. Southbound foot southbound. This guy. It's all over, dude. It's all over. Where's he going to go? He's going to go down to the canals. Going down the stairs. Going down the stairs. Unbelievable. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go around this way. Right down the stairs next to the, the dock next to the liquor store. Let me go down this way. He went all the way down. Yep, he's right there. They just got tackled. I believe he just got tackled. Yep, he got tackled. Five thirteen, one at Taser Point. Oh, we got a canine unit. <laughs> Good puppy. Challenge one. Good doggy. He's ten fifteen. Three five, I got one in custody. Three five, one in custody. I'm going to head back up there and secure the vehicle. I found a map, and it's got a house circled on it. So I don't know if that was a target of theirs. I I think the original call was he was at a residence digging. So I'm... Okay, what's it? It was 184 Amarillo. Yeah, that's the, that was the um, original location that they called in. All right, yeah, I just see a map in there, and that, that residence is circled on it. That's all I saw in there. Interesting. Yeah, not sure what to make of that. We'll have to get this thing towed out of here. Yeah, that'll be a fun tow for whoever has to come get it. <laughs> no kidding. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this episode of OCRP. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. A big thanks to uh, Elise joining the squad as far as the dispatching goes always good to have some more dispatchers and uh looking forward to more of it anywho that'll do it see you next time take care